Hey there, people in YouTube land. Uh, sorry for the uh, shaky mount here. Just wanted to do a, uh, a short video on the new uh, CRKT uh, Snailer carabiner and the uh, the CRKT Snailer. Just I just a keychain bottle opener type thing. Um, both both in steel. Um, there's a few questions. I've seen videos reviews of these before. I just wanted to uh, clarify a few things. Um, it's got a little bit of weight to it. It's super light though. Um, the gate itself has a lot of retention. Like it's, it's the snap on this thing is, is, is nothing, um, short of what you would expect from this. It's it, for, for $9. I think I paid 10 bucks for this. Fucking ridiculous. I, I'll probably end up buying a few more of it. Uh, I'd feel absolutely secure putting this on a belt loop. I don't feel like that's going to close enough for, for, for it to come off the belt loop. This thing is, it is, I've always wanted a real snailer. Um, I had my own clones made of these because I was so just in love with the design itself. Um, but this can still be used as, is is a, is a impact tool, which, you know, I, I feel like it would hurt your hand more, but, uh, Super nice. The details are good. Like it's I just got it today, but I carried it in my pocket just to see what it was all about. Uh they're all specifically numbered. Um they fit together right here at the gate. Sometimes you can see those uh there'll be like a design where it's like this will be the top of the gate and this will be the gate or vice versa. But when it closes, it wants to hit the the steel and not close properly like on the actual gate itself. So this does not have that problem. It's just a step up that's connecting to the other step up the negative step up step up so this thing is awesome uh this guy it opens bottles and shit um I, I i don't really like all the branding and shit on there but that's just me i could probably tumble or stonewash that off there funny enough i had a clone made of this a while ago there's my clone made out of straight up like military plate steel like um i believe it was quarter inch might have been less, maybe might have been eighth inch, but um, you can see they're very similar. Uh, mine is a little bit smaller than the uh, than the uh, CRK version, and I believe it's smaller than the original version too. Uh, but I also made clones of the actual snail as well, which same thing. I was off on size by a little bit. You can tell my my this is plate steel as well. Uh, the clone was just a little bit bigger than the real thing, uh, which is okay. Um, my version is way heavier like it's full on straight up just punch somebody in the head like this is a legit clone like i i had somebody cut that out for me. so um awesome um but here's the uh the brass version of it but uh maybe they'll make a brass version of this that would be cool uh but anyways yeah as far as like keys go um the carabiner itself is 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 perfect, man. I feel like you could put just a key ring through here and carry just a couple keys on it. Um, but uh, for nine dollars from CRKT, that's a good deal. So you should totally go buy one. This was a uh, six ninety five, I believe. I paid this for these three items. I paid forty dollars, and that was the knife itself was twenty. This is the Razzle, um, twenty bucks. For the knife itself, I think I paid $9.95 for this and then $6.95 for this. So I end I probably end up buying more of these just to uh put the uh, put them in gifts and stuff like for Christmas and things. But look how cute they are. Look how cute everybody is. I got all kinds of shit. Got it all. Oops. Except for that one. Got him. Got him! There it is. And then of course my uh, mini chugger as well, which I anodized a while ago, but you can see the anodized rubbed off on it and the sweet bead that I've got. Anyways, I uh, just wanted to give you a nice little vid on this side. And there's a few other um, reviews of it, but like they just go over the specifications. Like honestly, like I would use this, like I would put a key ring in there. Just another view of what they look like and how big they actually are. and. You can tell, like, they're very well made, though. Like, for what you're paying for, they're 
for nine dollars, man, that's a good, that's a good deal. I spent, phew, fuck, I don't know. Just getting these water jetted, this costed way more, so definitely worth it.